This presentation, this workshop, was created for your mime and pop operation. And how do you survive in this crisis that we're going through? Especially when you're competing against organizations that have been well established. What we uh, do with this presentation is to give you the two tests necessary to compete against those well established nonprofits. Um, what did Nipsey say? They don't know what I know. Because when they think you're coming at them, they don't know that you know what you're going to learn today. You want to rethink the whole narrative on your approach to providing the services necessary for the clients that you service. So this whole presentation, this whole workshop that we get is for those mom and pop operations that has a burning desire, desire to make a change, but you're being black because you're not part of the elite, the well-established. Well, here's the knowledge base necessary to compete Get the money and service your clients. So let's get started. Nonprofit and community uh, development. So you meant this particular individual right here a while back when we was talking about the possibility of doing the CEO training. So just before I talk about what does it include, share with the public who you are and what type of nonprofit you are and what you do. Oh, okay. Um, my name is Tosin Julius and I'm with the Midtown Outreach Inc. I'm sorry, it's a little loud where I work. So I to come out with that. Um, we're a pharmacy in the Tampa Bay area and we are here to service the patients that are not able to afford their AIDS drugs. So the reason why we want to, you know, get the nonprofit is to be able to help the community for the people who cannot afford to pay for their meds. All right, that's good enough. So let's talk about what does the training consist of? Well, first is board training. Second, we're going to do what's known as a SWAT analyst on your organization. We're gonna look at your strengths, your weaknesses, your opportunities and your threats. Then we're gonna talk about doing a strategic and operational plan and a business plan. Now, what people fail to realize is that there is a difference between a strategic plan and a business plan. A strategic plan looks at the internal operation of the organization in terms of of do we have everything we need to reach our mission and our vision? A business plan looks at the money. How do we bring in money? So we're going to talk about a business plan. The other thing, the training, okay. the training is going to assist up is program development as well as, as well as program design. We're talking about the theory of change, evaluation. Um, um, strategy, a special logic model, financial management and funding, compliance and regulations. What we find is that a lot of nonprofits that doing that's doing good, but they're not in compliance, or they're not doing the legal requirements related to the regulation. The other thing we're going to do is what's known as community outreach partnership and collaboration. So as you go after money, you got partners that's part of that particular strategy. Then the next thing is communication. How do you communicate with lenders, investors, politicians, and funders? That's a total different language. Then we're gonna look at uh, fund, fund development, grant development, including foundations, corporations, government, 
as well as individuals. Mm -hmm. Now, specific to your organization as your packet, we're also going to do Grant the Sam and the 340B as part okay. of your total packet. And yes. finally, it's going to include leadership development as well. So as you can see, you got what we call the deluxe packet. Everything okay. and anything. And why is that important? As you begin to go to funding, the first thing they're going to ask, have you gotten any internal training? And that's when you begin to say, oh, yeah, have we got training? And you begin to talk about your streets of plan and all those things of that nature. Yes. So any questions before we get started? And tonight is just an overview, a quick overview. Okay. In the coming days, I'm going to be working on the SWOT analysis. So I'm going to be asking a lot of information about the organization. How do you operate? What are you uh, what are your uh, for policies and procedures? All that stuff like that related to that. So any questions? And I'm um, I'm so happy that you're joining us. Besides, besides you, we're working with a nonprofit organization and doing CEO training in 10 different states. We offer a new school next generation approach okay. to nonprofits. Unlike most nonprofits that look for grants, we're teaching you how to do a business model. Whereas though you're going to want grants, but most of your money is going to come through what's known as earned income. And we're going to talk about earned income strategies later. That includes owning and operating your own nonprofit businesses within your nonprofit. So that being said, any questions? Any questions? No, no. Excellent. I can no. tell.